in this economy. Job loss is a huge reality, as we've been telling you all morning. You're seeing it every day. More and more companies under forced to lay off more and more people and for folks out there joining the unemployment line versus joining the workforce. So how do you get an edge up on the competition and get back in the game before there's even a line forming in front of you? Well, you have to get some help and that's what a lot of people are doing and they're calling on headhunters to do it. Joining us this morning to talk about the benefits of using such a firm is Dan Fantasia. He's the president and CEO of TreeLine, one of the area's largest executive search firms in the nation. It's very nice to see you this morning. Yes, good morning. Thank nice you for you. coming in. You. you know, you and I were just chatting off yeah. camera and talking about the fact that when you do receive that pink slip and you sort yeah. of get yourself pulled back together, you really have to get a strategy. Yeah. You have exactly to get right. out there. That's right. You know, I think the, um, the first step to developing a strategy is belief. Building belief in yourself, having the confidence to go out there and go get it, make it happen. Don't wait for anyone else. Empower yourself. Sure. Empower but, yourself. You know, there's so many folks out there who have never been unemployed. Yeah. I mean, you know, so this is this is a shock to a yes. lot of people. Now, you you've started to tell us as you search. The first thing you said is you have to believe in yourself. The next thing you say is identify your target market. Now, what does that mean? That's exactly right. Identify what industries are growing, what mm -hmm. markets are finding financial backing. Where is their growth? in the economy and then identify what companies are in those market segments and go after them. Introduce yourself to the world into those organizations. Do those companies exist out there, Dan? Because yes. right now we all feel like just nothing is growing and everything is just down. Yes, That's absolutely. not necessarily the case. Yes, that's all correct. Right. Develop a plan of attack. Yes. Um, when you're looking at the job market, when you believe in yourself and you identify who you need to be talking to, the next big point is develop a plan of attack. Don't focus necessarily on the job. Focus on the activity that you need to drive to get a job. So let's say you develop a goal, a set of goals every day to send out 10 resumes. If you send out 10 resumes per day, you'll send out 70 resumes over a week. If 10% of those companies call you, that's seven companies that call you. Let's say three decide and want to interview with you. Sure. Now, let's say at the end of the day, after you meet with three companies, it takes nine companies, let's say, to find a job. That means over three weeks, if you focus on simple goals every day of sending 10 resumes on a daily basis, you will have opportunities in three or four weeks. Right. And it's not so overwhelming. It's not. As looking at the big picture. That's right. And there's success along the way, which That's keeps exactly right. you motivated to keep going, I would think. That's exactly right. You say network. Oh, yes, of course. Network. Meet, reach out to everyone you know. Mm -hmm. Talk to as many people as you possibly can. Introduce yourself once again to the world. Use the job boards. Use social network sites like LinkedIn and Facebook and MySpace. And, of course, talk to executive search firms. Sure. Absolutely. Don't be embarrassed. A lot of people are in this position, yes, aren't they? That's exactly that's right. That's a problem for that's a lot. Exactly right. No relationships with a search firm, as you just said. Now, yes. we want to talk some of the benefits of using a search firm, because I think a lot of people out there are a little intimidated by that. Oh, well, I, maybe I don't have the right kind of resume, but that's not necessarily the case, is it? In, in many cases, search firms will help you with your resume. Okay, terrific. And, you know, the nice thing about an executive search firm is that many opportunities that search firms have are not, the public just doesn't have access right. to. Right, right, right. And which is the very first point you bring up. That you have, I have access to job opportunities. That's exactly right. That's mm -hmm. exactly right. There are jobs out there, and many companies will use services like ours because they don't want to necessarily post an advertisement. They don't want to receive thousands of resumes. They're looking for a specific individual for their organization, and in order to do that, they need search firms to streamline the process. Right, which is something that you guys do. You sort of just weed out some of those candidates who would be best qualified. Um, you help build a strategy around your qualifications. Yes, of course. Yeah. yeah. You provide information about alternative options. Now, now, explain that to me. Yeah, in many cases, you start off in a career, mm -hmm. and you get the blinders on, and you run hard for that career, and you have promotions, and you grow. Unfortunately, because you're so focused on advancement and growth, you never have an opportunity to see what other industries are out there, mm -hmm. what other opportunities are out there, and there are tons sure. of different jobs and opportunities for everyone. Yeah, and for a lot of people, this can be a new beginning, something new for everyone. And if you keep your current and well-educated on the job market. Yes, yes. Uh, the nice thing about search firms is um, whether you're actively or selectively considering new opportunities, mm -hmm. you should always be in touch with a search firm to educate yourself on what's going on in the market. If the perfect opportunity comes across my desk, 
Don't you want to hear about it? Sure. If right. you if you're not educated, if you don't have someone looking out for you, you'll never know when a better opportunity comes up. Now they're telling us we're just about out of time, but let me ask you a quick question yeah. about search firms. They're they're specific for different career lines, correct? Correct. Okay, so you need to sort of find your first job once you're unemployed is to find the correct search firm for you. That's exactly right. Okay. Yes. Uh, do you want to get in touch with Dan? Find out if his firm is the right one for you. You can visit their website. It's Treeline Dash Inc. Dot com, and and you guys can sort of help folks and direct them in the right way. Absolutely, yeah. Okay. If we can't help them, we'll refer them to other firms. That's terrific. It's so nice to yeah, meet nice you. Nice to Continued meet you as success. Well. Thank you. It's great to see you.